All right. Our first day out there, bone fishing with Kalani Chapman, and we see some big fish, right? What, what do you think? That was yeah. pretty nuts, right? Yeah, no, that was super rad. Um, you know, just like, they're hard to see, first of all. So if you even see one or do see one, you're like beyond excited. And quite a few times I didn't know what to do, even though I was being <laughs> perfectly, you know, guided and told what to do. I was just so excited I kind of blew it, but... um. Yeah, and that, that's the thing out there. Like sometimes you're you're walking and you're just not seeing something, and then all of a sudden when you see one, you're like, oh, you get so excited, like start losing track of whatever you're taught and what you're supposed to do is just like happens so fast. And at at the end of the day, we seen that nice big ulua, the big GT. That thing came right in. That thing was radical. <laughs> one of the boys was like, hey, look at look, there's an ulua right there, <laughs> and it was literally at our feet, and. uh I had the pole with the crab on it, and I went, or, excuse, uh, no. No. no, no, sorry about that, with the, uh, the lure on it, and, uh, yeah, I pretty much failed heavily, I went to cast my pole, and, uh, what is it, the, yeah, so he had the crab jig on there, we know. threw out the crab jig, and it landed a little short, the thing started turning out, and I had the bubble floater with the small pink fly, and immediately I threw one way out there, and bro, the big thing turned all the way back, came all the way right back to our feet. The thing like literally came right, you could have kicked the darn thing. It was rad. That like, was crazy exciting. Definitely man. not expected to see a fish that big in such shallow of water. It was, um, I, you don't ever see that. And it was literally like <laughs> five feet from our feet, so. Yeah, and he, he, we're out here on the North Shore right now, and, and that's just not too far away from here. So it's a good little fishing spot, real close out here. And, you know, Makani from Fly Fishing Hawaii, he hooked a nice bone right off the bat. That was, like, crazy epic. He's, like, yeah. got the bonefish finger right now, so that was pretty sick. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he had a fly pole, too. But, yeah, 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 that was a fun day. I mean, we'll definitely get after him, and maybe later on this week tomorrow we'll, we'll get right back on them we're gonna go about to maybe the triangle in honolulu and we're gonna put you yeah. on to some fish that's you know i did turf. catch a fish today it was only a, a small very small stick fish but i caught something so i'm not totally you know bummed but <laughs> moving forward i'm gonna be positive and we're gonna catch a big fish most likely tomorrow yeah let's do it cheers yep we're on tomorrow for sure much aloha yeah. All right, perfect. <laughs>